Hey, so this is my home for the night. With a big giant fallen tree as my backdrop. Let's just hope it don't roll over on me. Barricade over that way. A river down there. It's beautiful. Yeah, I had to stop in the town last night to resupply before I go to Blood Mountain. <laughs> Fucking expensive, I ain't gonna say. It's three. I ain't even gonna say. Over $300 I spent in town. This is a perfect chance for me to show you my tent setup. It's, it's muddy, but I'd rather that mud be dry than wet, you know? Just gotta stand around here and wait for a bit for it to dry. I don't mind. It's a warm sun and it's a cool breeze. Oh, Mr. Tree. Makes me feel like such a hobbit. Sleeping next to this tree tonight. Oh. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'm a naturalist. Um, my bandana. There's a little pocket here, too, which is very useful. I got nature getting in my tent, though. Yeah, and as you see, I have the mattress off to the left side. Um, things will bunch up there. But I might just keep the rain fly off for a bit, just to enjoy the sun. There's this light bar that comes with the tent that holds the poles. And it's also a diffuser, you can put your stuff inside here. So this piece holds the tent. And it's a good water bottle holder, actually. It keeps your water upright. And I do use this one. And it also holds my phone. Let's see what this, okay. So it will hold things such as water bottle, and it's good, you know? So this is my little area here. I don't have to worry about shit, but drying this tent. You see that? You know what that is? Yeah, I think you know what that is. That's a blister. I got some mole skin.